No, I'll yeah. give it a three because you know what? You know also why? Because somehow, somehow, in some way, even though they weren't complete, like a full fledged story, for some reason, most of the songs on there, I felt like he was still telling a story some weird way. Yeah, if that makes sense. I don't know if that makes sense. But when you listen to like Capital Punishment, Beware, like even though you know what I mean, but it's just like I guess it's just because of the way that he's rhyming and the way he's delivering it. It almost, you know, you kind of forget, like, yeah, it's not really like a story, but it sounded like a story because of the way he was saying. So, you know, it's kind of weird. Uh, Cause think about it. Did you? Did you? Did that? Did you realize that back then when it first came out? Like, did it catch your attention right away? Yeah, that's just because I'm a rapper, though. But then I guess to answer your question, does every classic album need to have a story? And obviously, I'm going to say, no, it doesn't. Mm. So then... Because I consider Capital Punishment a classic. Right. It's still a classic. Remember, the question on this channel is always just how classic is the classic. Now, if we're going to compare this to Illmatic, probably going to get a lower rating because Nas did everything on Illmatic that Pun did on this with the story (laughs) and the (laughs) concept and the wordplay. I guess it all, it really depends on what the person's, nope. you know, <laughs> it has to depend on what the person's criteria is for, for rating a classic. This is the criteria. That's what I'm saying. If we measured Illmatic through the same scale, everything that you gave pun something low on, you would give Nas high on. You'd have to give this concept high for one love. You'd have to but, give- but, but, okay. So you said, but okay. But we're saying Capital Punishment is a classic, right? Absolutely. And Illmatic is a classic. Absolutely. So it's just a matter of which classic is a little bit higher than the other. Yeah, but they're still it. both classic. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's so, like if we if we rounded up Casino, Godfather, Goodfellas, and Donnie Brasco, Godfather probably trumps all of them because it probably hits more the angles of a classic than some of the others. Which one is the most talked about, E, in more circles? I'm saying The Godfather, but it's also <laughs> because of when it came out. You know what I mean? It was the first, you know, it came out before Donnie Brasco. Like, Donnie Brasco, to me, is not even in the same. You know, Godfather 1 and 2, 3 was kind of whack. You know what I mean? <laughs> um, Godfather 1 and 2 was a classic, you know, obviously. Donnie Brasco, to me, is a classic, too, though. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like, now, am I going to say which one? I mean, I love Al Pacino. I'm right. a huge Al Pacino fan, so he's in both. So to me, of course, I'm going to say Godfather because that's what I saw him in before Donnie Brasco. Right. And Listen, it has yeah. classic, you know, it has, there's more to it, you know what I mean, than, than Donnie Brasco. These, but all these, I'm saying is, though, that classic is a classic. Now, if we're going to talk about where is the classic, then okay. That's exactly, I that's exactly I, what we're talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we didn't get to that. We just <laughs> yeah. So like, again, that the, the whole reason the thing exists is, is to, you know, if we had to use process of elimination of classics, yeah, we start getting into a, oh, one of these got to go. Right, I get one. Right. If we had like five albums that we call a classic, and then you say to me, all right, we have to. Um, we are out of the five we need to pick one and then now we start breaking it down of course like for example based on what you're saying pun i'm just saying the uh, capital punishment would take an l to l matter right so out of the five we was like okay we already eliminated ca- capital punishment what are the next ones right i yeah, get so, you man i get it I that's, get that's, it. that's a, and at the end of the day <laughs> It, this is not, you know, it's a separate conversation for favorite. We were talking about basketball players. Sean Kemp is my favorite, but if, Ooh, that's my. <laughs> but Michael Jordan is a better basketball player. Yeah, I can't yeah, yeah, yeah. Do that, right? So, right, right, right. What you like is still what you like at the end of the day. But if we were having a barbershop argument and you try to tell me Pun has better concepts on this album, oh no, no, then, no, no. no. Or, or right, any right, of these right, right. That we're talking about, right? If you're like, no, nah, Pun got better stories, I'm like, uh, the stats show that he doesn't. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. No, I get, it, I get it. So okay. I get it. I get it. <laughs> so for storytelling, you're giving this a three. I give it a three. Okay. 